Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can display videos inside of widget elements inside Unreal Engine. Maybe you want to use a video as a background inside of your main menu. This video will show you how you can import and use videos inside Unreal Engine. Let's get into it. Hello, to get started, you want to head over to the content folder of your Unreal Engine project. Then you want to right click and create a new folder and make sure it's called Movies. Then head inside this folder. The folder needs to be named Movies, otherwise this won't work. It's specified in the Unreal Engine documentation. If we want to basically play videos inside Unreal Engine, all the videos need to be stored in a folder called Movies. Then we just want to right click on this folder and go Show in Explorer. Then add all of the videos that you want to show inside of your Unreal Engine project to this folder. So I've now done that. I've added this cool background of a ninja that I found online. Then we just want to import all of our movies into this folder. So we just want to go to import, go over to your movies folder and then select your movie, double click and open it up. If you've done everything correctly, the file path should just look like this. If you've not done it correctly, there'll be a warning error triangle. So make sure your movies are stored inside of the movies folder in order to remove that. Once you've done that, you can then just close this. Then we just want to right click, go over to media and select a media player. Select Video Output Media Texture Asset, then select OK. And then I'm just going to call this my background media player. Double click on it. And then just double click. And you should be able to see a preview of your video. That's looking good. I'll then just close this. Then we just want to select the um, media texture file that it created for us. Right click on this and go Create Material. Double click on this. Select this and go over to Material Domain and change this to be User Interface. Then connect from RGB into the final color and just click Apply. Next, we want to display our video on a widget. To do that, I'm just going to go over to my third person folder, over to the Blueprints folder, and then I'm just going to right click, go over to the User Interface, select a widget blueprint, and then the user widget. I'll just call this my video underscore widget blueprint. I will open this up. Go over to the palette and look for a canvas panel. Drag this inside here. Then I'm just going to look for an image. Drag this image inside my canvas panel. And I'm just going to go to anchors and select this one in the bottom right. And then for the offset, I'm just going to put a value of zero. That way it stretches this image across the whole of the uh, screen. Then for the image, just go over to appearance, then brush. And look for whatever you called your material. So mine was called the background media player. So I'll just select that. We then just want to go over to our graph and create a new variable. Call it media player. Go to variable type and look for a media player. Select object reference and go compile. Here under the variable, select the video you want to play. So for me, it's the background media player. Then we just want to drag in our media player, get it, and event construct. We're just going to drag up here and look for open source. And then select the video you want to play. And this will start playing my video. Normally with videos, depending on what you're using them for, you may want the video to loop. So for example, if say you're using the video as a background from your main menu, you may want the video to loop. So to do that, we can then just drag off the media player, look set, looping, and just make sure it's checked. Then connect from here into here. Compile this, and then we just need to make it so this video can appear on the screen. So I'm just going to go to my third person character, and I'll make it when they press the one key. I will just create a widget. The widget will be the video widget blueprint, and then I will add this to the viewport. I'll then compile this, close this, and go play. And when I press one. I can see my video playing. Nice. Now you could also use this with something like a main menu. And if you're interested in learning how to create multiple different types of main menus, for example, a video main menu, a background main menu, an image main menu, and every system that you need to have with making a main menu, like graphics options and all of that, I recently just made a how to make a professional main menu course inside Unreal Engine. 
is included as part of my master bundle. If you're interested in that, make sure to check it out. There'll be a link to it in the description of this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.